Hello everyone, welcome to uh, Spear Hauling Props, and today in this video I thought, why not give uh, you guys a quick tour of where I store my Spear Hauling Props. Now, it's been about three years since this channel started, and one of the first videos I uploaded on here was where I stored my Spear Hauling Props, and I thought, you know, why not just kind of make it do it again, because, well, first of all, that was three years ago, and second of all, that was in my old house. Um, and you know, since I moved into another house, uh, I'll just show you guys, you know, where I store my spear hauling props because, you know, it's, you know, it's been like, you know, in a completely different house and, uh, and also that was three years ago and, you know, I've collected more props over the years. So I thought, you know, why not give you guys another tour, um, and just kind of where they store them. So oh, also, by the way, if you, if you guys are wondering why it's really dark, um, we have rain outside. So yeah. It never usually rains where I live, but, yep, it's raining today, on a perfect day, to make a video. So, uh, yeah, so I guess I'll give you guys a quick tour of where I store my spear horn props, in case you guys are interested. And, um, yeah, so first we're going to start with, uh, well, there's different areas where I store them, but, well, two areas, and the first one is my closet, basically. So this closet is, um, is okay, I would say. I'll show you guys what I store in here, um, but it's not the best. I mean, it's super, super small. I mean, if you compare it to, like, my closet that I used to have back in the older house that I used to live in, it was super big, and this one's pretty small. But I guess I'll show you guys what I have in here. So let's go ahead and open it, and I'll show you guys what's in here. Okay, so um, so up here we have... So don't mind all the other crap in here I gotta uh, handle, but... Um, so up here, yeah, there's puppets, puppets and stuff up here, but up here we have Twy Twitcher's head. Um, up here, and I also have the box as well over here. This is really hard to see. I'll turn the light on, I guess. So yeah, over here I have Twilight Twitcher's box, um, which is really really cool. Um, and I had I've had him for a while as well. So uh, I I thought I had you know like I was like I should probably store this in my closet because you know um, he's one of my favorite props of all time, and I just kind of thought you know. Um, I only pay, I didn't pay that much for him, so I might as well keep him nice and good instead of, you know, out in the garage, but I'll show you guys what I have stored out there. And up here we have his head, like I said, and up here are, um, Limb Ripper's legs. <laughs> yeah, basically his legs, I stored them up there just because, um, because, you know, they were starting to deteriorate. I mean, this is the, and by the way, this is the 2017 version, but they start to deteriorate. I noticed, so I decided to um, store them up here in the closet because where it's kind of warmer and, you know, it's just probably better. And I also have the limb that he's holding up there. I also store it up there. It's very, very hard to get to get those those uh, leg pieces up there and all those parts. And also, I have my Robo Sapien up there as well. So yeah, that's kind of what the deal is about the closet. And over here is Rosemary. I have another prop. These are all the kind of precious items I, I have I have up there so in in this closet so yeah I have Rosemary right here you can see her arms right here um and I just you know put her in a bag because I you know I want to make sure she's in um pretty stable up here um stable in there um and like I said she's one of my favorite props of all time so I thought you know I gotta keep her nice and good just to make sure you know because man they're very delicate I mean I mean I accidentally ripped um a piece off of her one time by accident, but yeah, so she's nice and good, and I have all, you know, I have that, <laughs> not many words to stay, say about this, but yeah, so like I said, I have Twilight Twitcher up here, I have Limber's legs and arms, um, uh, Twilight Twitcher's head, and, uh, well, I also have Robo Sapien, and Rosemary, Rosemary up here, so yeah, that's kind of the closet deal, um, and I can't fit anything else in this closet, I mean, <laughs> yeah, I, I can't fit anything else in here, so uh, let me show you guys, uh, where the, um, uh, let me take you guys on a little quick trip to the garage, so yeah. Alright everyone, welcome to my garage, <laughs> and I guess I will, uh, get started with the tour of, uh, where I store my props, so, um, or my animatronics and basically my tabletop. So, over here, this is where I came out of, so, yeah, so over here I guess we're gonna start with, uh, Loom Hipper. so, Limb Ripper I got only a few months ago, I uh, think, uh, shout out to Spear Only 9 for that, uh, for uh, giving me his, and um, and yeah, so this, so he's actually the uh, most heaviest, uh, well, he's the most, well, heavy, he's pretty heavy, 
and he has the biggest box as well. So uh, it's pretty crazy, but yeah, he has a he's a pretty big box. So yeah, that's a limb ripper. And also, uh, don't mind all these this don't mind the speakers on the ground. I um I was actually cleaning them uh, earlier today because it's very dusty and I'm still working on it. So don't think I store my speakers like that that because I don't. And these are also the speakers. In case you're wondering, these are also speakers I um I use when I stream uh do my Halloween live streams in the, the garage, um on my uh, normal channel. So yeah. Anyway, so uh, let's move on. Uh, let's go over here actually. So up here we have Daddy Teddy, um, which is pretty cool. <laughs> He's just kind of on top of there. You pro you can probably see him, but yeah, that's uh, Daddy Teddy. We also have a um, hanging phantom right here. Um, so yeah, I got him a few years ago at a uh, Kmart, and um, when Kmart was still open, my Kmart was still open, and uh, yeah, he's pretty cool. I haven't used him in a while, but yeah. We also have a brown jumping spider right here. Uh, he's actually not in the box, but you know, we have a werewolf right here, uh, <laughs> another werewolf, and we have a uh, witch right here that I actually got you know a while ago. And then over here we have we have a uh, th this is where I <laughs> this is where I put the fleshing zombie. Uh, I don't have the original box, um, but yeah, this is where the flesh <laughs> this is where I put the fleshing zombie, uh, which is pretty cool. And it says decker decker on it because that's you know how it came like. But yeah, that's where the fleshing zombie is. Um, and uh, he's pretty he's stored pretty well I would say up here. <laughs> I didn't really know where to put him, but I just kind of decided you know I'll put him right here. And then down here we have um, some. Uh, more Halloween tabletops right here. We have a skull right here. Uh, we have some jemmy stuff over here. And uh, we have another skeleton. You probably can see that right here. We have another skeleton right there. And um, and yeah, and you could probably think, is this are these uh, boxes uh, squishing it? Uh, I don't think so, actually, because I put a bunch of uh, padding. So I don't really think... Oh, also, there's another skull right there. So yeah, I don't think... I don't think... Um, I don't think it's really squishing it that much. Uh, so I think it's alright. But yeah. And also we have another bin, Halloween uh, bin right here with just other tabletops and other decorations. And uh, yeah, so that's that's pretty cool. So yeah. Um, and over here we have Pumpkin Guardian of the Grave. Uh, I got him a few years ago and um, <laughs> brought, brought, with, brought him, um, you know, during this whole move out thing to the garage. Um, so yeah, he's pretty cool. I really like him. And uh and yeah, so I kind of, you can see his head sticking out. I didn't really know what other way to, you know, where else to kind of put him. So I just kind of put him like that. Um, and then over here we have Deadly Roots. And um, and yeah, so kind of with all these props, I'm just kind of planning on like storing them kind of this section of the garage. So kind of like over here mostly. Uh, we also have some, we have a fog machine and some fog juice. Yeah, we have a bunch of crap in the garage, but you know... <laughs> It's, it's, um, I hope, you know, we get to organize it at least someday. I mean, it's pretty organized, but we got to get rid of some things, but definitely not the Halloween stuff. <laughs> but yeah, so we have Deadly Roots right here. And, uh, you know, he's pretty cool. It's kind of hard to put him away. It's hard, it's easy to set him up, but it's really hard to put him away. So, yeah. So yeah, that's, uh, Deadly Roots. And then we have Burlap 4 right here, which is another prop that's kind of hard to put away. You have to have some parts kind of, um, sticking out. So, Yeah. <laughs> that's brought up horror and then we have this butler that I got a very long time ago um uh that last time I uh checked he still works although uh he's like his poles are breaking and he's just kind of he's in a little bit of a mess right now because there's like a pole right here his feet are are basically sticking out as well so he's kind of in a in a he's not in a good he's not in good shape but he still works um, but we're planning um, this fall to kind of fix them up a little bit. So, yeah. Then over here we have um, I got a uh, Sunstar clown for Christmas a few months ago, and um, we just kind of have him in his box right there because um, there's not really anywhere else to kind of put him. But yeah, so he's pretty cool. Uh, he's the Sunstar clown from Spirit, the one that uh, doesn't move or the one that doesn't shake. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty cool. And uh, we have Demonica right here. Um, which I also have her sticking out of her box. It's really hard to put these guys away. Um, but she's, you know, doing pretty good. <laughs> um, and yeah, so, yeah, that's Demonica. This is the 2011 version. Then right here we have Rosemary's box, um, which I kind of forgot that I had the box because it's kind of hidden from everything. Um, but yeah, I still have her box. 
Uh, there's nothing in it, but you know, I still like keeping the boxes. Then we have Shotgun Blast Zombie right here. Uh, thanks to uh, Spear Halloween 9 for giving this to me. <laughs> Once again, shout out to you, Spear Halloween 9, for giving me a uh, Shotgun Blast Zombie. Um, and yeah, he's really, really cool. I really like him. I only, you know, very nice of him to do that. Um, but yeah, that's a Shotgun Blast Zombie. All right, let's uh, kind of go over here. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just kind of running out of uh, ideas. Not running out of ideas, but running out of words to say. So over here we have Hovering Ghost that I got only a, only a, well, what am I talking about? I got him uh, a long time ago. Uh, he's my second prop, second animatronic that I ever got. And um, he's doing pretty good, I would say. I mean, other than his eyes not lining up, you know, he's pretty cool. And I also have to, you know, in case my, my parents accidentally throw something away, I have to write down what it is. <laughs> um, and then over here we have the Untimely Death Statue that once again Spear Halloween 9 gave to me, which um, was very kind of him. And um, and I got to fix her mouth, too, because it's deteriorating really, really badly. So I got to fix that this fall. Because, <laughs> you know, I, I haven't turned her on for a while, but I gotta, I, I gotta fix her her mouth. But yeah, I'll find some way to do that. And then over here we have uh, the brown jumping spider, which I have him wrapped in a plastic bag. Then over here we have a pumpkin guy that I got at Kmart as well the same day that I got the uh, uh, phantom. So that's pretty cool. And then back there we have some a few other decorations, and we also have a rising from the grave. Um, with the light up eyes um, that I got, that that was my first ever animatronic that I ever got. Uh, but I can't really show you guys because first of all, this stuff is kind of in the way, and it's gonna be really hard to get him get him out. But yeah, he's 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 back over there, so yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, and I think that's pretty much it. I think that's everything. Oh, we also, you know, we also have we have decorations lying out here. I think over here is the talking bus, um, the mini mini talking bus. And uh, I think that's pretty much it. There's nothing, no Halloween stuff over here. This is more of the summertime kind of stuff. Don't mind all this, all this trash. We got to really go through it. But um, yeah, so I thought, you know, why not make this video on a, on a rainy day because it's pretty rainy and the wind is pretty strong as well. So um, yeah, I just kind of decided to make a video like this in case you guys are wondering where I store my uh, spear hauling props or... Um, you know where I just where where I store all those all these guys because uh, man I've collected a, a lot since uh, uh, only three years ago because three years ago I only had a f I only had a few really I still had a lot but I didn't have I didn't have this many as I did now so um, so yeah anyway I'm gonna end this video right here thank you guys for watching if you guys have any questions or any suggestions I should do. On, uh, on this channel, please let me know, or any questions or su suggestions that Spear Holy 9 and I should do, uh, let us know in the comment section below. And um, like I said, if uh, I'm probably going to be uploading a lot more reviews um, around this fall, so if you're interested, uh, please let me know, because I would like to uh, definitely, um, you know, <laughs> you know, make some videos and stuff on here, because I didn't really make that video many videos last year, but... I definitely want to make more videos uh, on this channel, so yeah. So anyways guys, I'm getting this video right here. Uh, there's a link in the comment section below if you guys want to check out my channel, uh, Team Vlogger. You guys want to check that out. Um, also there's another link if you guys want to check out Spear Holy Nine's channel. It's in the same, you know, section. So if you want to check out his channel, uh, please let me know. Well, not let me know, just click on the link. Uh, so anyways guys, I'm getting this video right here. Thank you guys for watching. Um, like I said, any questions or suggestions or anything like that uh, let me know and i will uh and i will reply to as many as i can so anyways guys i'm gonna end this video right here we're almost to 100 subscribers which is crazy <laughs> but yeah anyways guys thank you guys for watching this is team vlogger and um and yeah so i guess i will see you guys when i make more videos on, on this channel um and yeah so anyways guys i'll see you guys in the next video and uh that's it